Our first step in the Fibron cladding assembly is to install an effective weather-resistant barrier. DuPont Tyvek, the recognized leader in the industry, provides an excellent balance of water and air holdout values with a vapor permeability that promotes drying. Install to manufacturer specifications with minimum overlaps and proper flashing details at all windows, doors, and other penetrations. With DuPont Tyvek, start at the lower corner of a building and shingle in a weatherboard fashion. Always maintain a minimum of 6 inch overlap at both horizontal and vertical weather barrier joints. Attach the weather barrier with capped fasteners to maintain water and air holdout performance. It is required to tape vertical seams with Tyvek tape, and highly recommended to use Tyvek tape on horizontal seams as well. Step two is to incorporate a rain screen product that creates a minimum 3 8 inch or 10 millimeter gap between the cladding and the weather barrier. This rain screen gap allows moisture that makes its way past the cladding to drain, while encouraging drying by creating a continuous airflow loop between the cladding and the WRV. We like this product, Keen Drywall UV Rain Screen which not only fulfills the gapping requirements, but also provides an ebony UV resistant layer to protect the weather barrier and create a uniform dark background for your cladding. Place drywall rain screen horizontally against the exterior wall, fabric side out. The entangled core should face the building interior. Start at the bottom of the wall and work up. Mechanically fasten with an appropriate length nail, staple, or screw. One fastener per square foot. It is important to never fasten through your window flashing. Seam adjacent drywall rain screen pieces with the selvage flap overlapping the previously installed section. Finally, we begin installing our Fiberon cladding system. Fiberon cladding's high quality composition creates a low maintenance product with excellent fade resistance. With eight natural hardwood emulating colors, you have a wide palette to create a beautiful facade. We like to ensure that the surface is flat and level before installation. Plan out your courses to fulfill your design goals. In extreme temperatures, it is wise to allow boards to acclimate prior to installation. It's important to test your fasteners prior to wall installation to guarantee the desired aesthetic. As you install the first course, it's very important to begin with a level board. Fasteners are installed through the face at every 16 inches on center. Position your screws 1 inch from side edges and 1.5 inches from the board ends. Leave an open gap between cladding boards to allow for thermal expansion and contraction. Typically, between 1 16th of an inch and 3 16th of an inch. Reference your installation guide for the right minimum for your exterior temperature. Avoid budding boards above windows, doors, and other openings. Regularly verify that you're continuing to install each board level with the course underneath. Continue installing your courses until the final board. If your top cladding piece is under 3 inches wide, pre-drill your fastener holes. Using the right materials, you can construct a striking hardwood exterior look with a moisture management system that maintains its appearance for years to come. 
It's as easy as one, two, three.